Hello guys and welcome to Matt's Beatner. This is part two of three of the Moskvich Museum Tour featuring the sports cars. Part one featured the classics, so this is quite a short video. First up is this number 28 rally car based on the Moskvich 412. It's a replica, I think, due to the originals not really surviving. It competed in the London to Mexico rally back in 1970. It was driven by Leonti Potacic, Eduard Vajhinov and Yuri Lesovsky. It came second in its class and 12th overall. Sorry, I'm not very good at saying Russian names. Next up are the Moskvich G5s. I believe the red one is a G5M. I'm sure someone will correct me anyway. These cars competed in the Soviet F1 series. This car had its 5-speed gearbox which was mounted behind the engine and rear axle. This car had a few engines over the years. I wish I had more footage to talk about them more. This car here is a Group B rally car known as the Moskvich and Aleko 2141. The normal 2141 road car was a front wheel drive car, but this car here was very unique. It tried using the very popular WRC Group B championship to help with the popularity of its road car. It is believed that the process of the KR began in 1986 and it had styling ideas from the Lada Samara EVA prototype. This car had a space frame tubular chassis. It is a mid-engine rear drive. Though the road car was a four-door car, this car here was effectively a coupe. What I love about it is that the bonnet and boot both open up as a clamshell, giving valuable access to the mechanicals. This 1988 car had a two-litre four-cylinder engine which had 175 horsepower and had an estimated top speed of 200 kilometers per hour. This car was very light. It only weighed 890 kilograms, which is even lighter than a 2011 Lotus Elise, which you probably all know is a very light car. Part three will be about the very unusual but cool concept cars from Moss Beach. I hope you like this video and please subscribe if you want to see the next one. Thank you so much and take care. Goodbye.